Yo, yo, everybody, and welcome to the next episode in Gunhilda's Cultist Struggles here in Storage, yeah, doing crime and stuff. Last we left off, we decided to do this, uh, fight this man from the Empire with uh, less troops, which is a very, very bad idea. Now, why is it a bad idea? Because he's got a lot of raid students, more than 30, so more than a third, and he's got cavalry and horse archers. It's all terrible. He's also got prisoners. Militia, ugh, nothing. Anyway, I guess we'll just have to do what we can, and there's only one thing we can do, really. Okay, well, this is not a great map, but maybe we're lucky. And yes, you might be thinking, oh, you said you had a great plan, there's only something you could do to win. And you're just charging them all in, and yes, that, that is exactly the only chance we've got. They have... Uh, what you might call it? Yeah, we need everybody to ignore these horse archers, by the way. They have archers! And if we spend a lot of time trying to do anything against them, like, ugh, we're screwed. We need to rush in. And our men not rushing in right now is a big problem. Okay. This, uh, our men are still not running in. Okay, yeah, no, this was the... Okay, well, what I wanted to do... See, I really wanted to have a battlefield where we were going up, down. You know, okay, we'll still try, we'll still try. Find a battlefield that goes from up to down. And hopefully a battlefield that our troops can just ignore the bloody ar horse archers. Because they were taking ages aiming their throwing weapons at them. You know what? This is fine. If this is the bridge level, we might still have a chance. Because then maybe we have a little bit of time. Where the horse archers don't matter too much. Now, I actually changed the throwing orbs so that... The trail shouldn't be there anymore, but uh, I actually lost them when I lost battles, so, so much for that. Ooh, wait, are they not coming over? If, if, no, if they're not coming over, we're not doing this. Okay, back off, because they're shooting at us. We need them to come over this bridge, or there's not really much reason to be here. I mean, they're attacking us. Is is there a reason they're standing over there? Uh, why are they standing up front? Come back, you idiots. Okay, uh, I see you guys are throwing weapons, you know, you can use those. They're not crossing the bridge, so we can actually kill these guys. They're still not crossing. I mean, at this rate, I'm just hit hitting whenever I can. If we hit kill their horses, it's also good. Okay, everyone look that way, please. Stop bloody rotating. These horses aren't uh, armored, so that's why I'm kind of alright, just uh, shooting at them. I'm not sure what this guy was doing. Well, I mean, if nothing else, we're just going to kill off these guys and then go back in again. I mean, their guys are just standing there still. Alright, we kill... They killed two of us, and we killed five. What's left? Okay. 
Hello. There we go. And now we can reset again. See? We can't leave. He has to charge at us. What is this shit? Alright. Another battlefield. It doesn't look great. And they still have cavalry. I hope this is his standard cavalry though. And not... Archer cavalry, because then we might be in a bit of a trouble. I hope this isn't a lake. This is oh, it's a goddamn lake. Okay, so we actually need to stand back. We need to stand back because we can't cross this because they've got an archer line. We just need to stand behind a hill and wait for them to come to us. And if they don't do that, well, then we are in a bit of a pickle here. Although it honestly does look like they're coming towards us, at least. Which is good. And those don't look like skirmishes, so that's also good. As soon as they are somewhat through the water, I'll, hey, I'll put my guys there. Alright, there we go. There we go. This is it. This is it. Everybody's got to run in, boys. Hopefully they ignore the cavalry and just go for it. Okay. Stop shooting. Run in. It's time to go ham, guys. Come on, die, horse. No? Okay. What? Oh, it's too laggy. I can't. Okay, yeah, we lost. Okay, well, uh, yeah, whatever, surrender. We... Yeah, we just don't... We can't deal with these guys because of ranged units. No, not ranged. Horse units, like my guys, just... The amount of IQ loss they get... From the enemies having cavalry is astounding. Like, even up in the melee, they just lost their bloody marbles and and tried to fight the horses instead of the guys that were standing there in line. Like, it's very embarrassing. Alright, and now I think the whole town of Varcheg is no longer under my control. Because of course not! What, why would it be? Game, can you stop lagging, please? Just let me get to a town and get some troops back. Because what we need to do is we need soldiers... We need a lot of soldiers, and we need to fight people. And after we fight people, do you know what we need to do? We need to give in captured prisoners to other sturgeons. And we need to do that. We need to do that because we want all the sturgeons to like us. If the sturgeons like us, then they will vote for us when Ragnvad is dead. Quite so. So, it's a bit important that we do that. Wait, are these our guys? Why is it not even set telling me that they were all in here? Is it because there's too many? Oh, this is someone new. Well, I don't need someone new right now. Melina, Lady Sun out. Yeah, I don't know if I can... We have 100 morale again from recent events. What happened? We just lost. I don't get it. This woman? Uh, she must have married someone. Yeah, for him. Alright, well, we'll take this quest. Quests are nice. You look like a very cheerful lady. That's lovely. She's not thinking we're going to do very well, but we will heal up before we do that tournament for her. And, uh... Owned areas. Two out of three. Take back. Yeah, but I don't really want to spend all my villainy points on that. Like... Why? Oh, we have an upgrade! Yay! Um, Comfort! One more gold, I guess. Woo! Not sure how that all works, but there we go. Not escorting nobody. 
Do you know what? I want to do the reveal your good fortune thing. Five points only. Yeah, okay. Yeah, cool. She doesn't have a shield. She has a shield. It's better than her shield. I guess she's happy now. I mean, I guess it's pretty. Eh. Alright, there's a wolf hat for you, lady. And we only had one. Damn it! We were supposed to have two! Oh well. Let's wait a little bit before we uh, rush into the tournament. Just so we know we win it. Okay, that's good enough. Alright then, let's tournament! Hello, Sir Archer. I was to say hello to you. Oh dear. Oh, not that much. Okay, nice, nice. I'm the only one left on my team. Excellent. Okay, red and blue. Green, whatever. Excellent. Get rid of the red guy and at least I will go on. And of course I didn't! Yay! I'm not very happy about this. I've got to say I'm very displeased. Oh well, at least Leshnik didn't take everything, although he took all the good ones because there's only crap in here now. Oh, Nero has been besieged by the Kuzites. Okay, cool, cool. We don't give a crap, man. That's not any of our business. We're just here to make sure that Sturger doesn't fall before we take over it. Although I've got a good, good feeling that it might. Let's do something. Gang tri We didn't do a gang trial before? Gang trial with who? Wait, we did. Pretty sure... One of these guys... Uh... No, I don't need to do it again. I'm pretty sure he is the one guy we've got. So, do we need to do any of these... Not really. Let's just do the scam for the funsies. And it was a fail. Yeehoo! Of course it was. Anyway, it's also good for, you know, roguery experience. Who doesn't love that? Meanwhile, we're just saying hello to these very distant, very distant, little places here. Why yes, I would love your recruits. Ah, there we go. Do you have an easy one? Bandit base near Ustakol. Hmm. We should just do that. Do you know what? I'm just gonna do it. Why not? I mean, he's gonna be able to give me some good troops and this seaside hideout never wants to do anything with me. Might as well punish them for their nastiness. Oh, right, and we need to get our all of our family and stuff back. Mimia, oh, it's escaped, nice. Oh, and now they want to let us do this stuff. Recruit bandits, 10 units for five points. Come on, then. And now we're going to attack it. All right, men. All right. Charge. There's really not much else to do, but I do think we might have to uh, discuss the re the recruitment and training process of the cultists with our overlords back home at some point, because we are we have a severe weakness to uh, cavalry, and it's really no good. Gunhilda thought that all of the throwing weapons would be exceptional against uh, cavalry, but it really isn't. And, none are, and whilst we have two-handed weapons, none of us have pole arms. So I suppose that is the... Excuse me, mate. How, how are you keeping on doing that? There we go. So we might have to consider that we need some of our guys to know how to use pole arms. Or something similar. Because 
we can't do my strategy of just rushing in and throwing our weapons on them and making them all hate life. Mostly because, uh... It just doesn't work. Like, the, all our guys get distracted by the cavalry. Which is bad. I mean, if we had some archers to take care of all those guys first, instead of wasting our stuff, maybe, maybe it would be good. I mean, I really didn't want to go with archers, but it might just be the only way we could deal with it. I mean, just... Just make the nobles, maybe, use bows. Uh, because then we don't have that many of them, but maybe we do have enough to stop the uh, horse archers from really being that bad for us. Because, I mean, honestly, it would kind of be okay if our guys could just ignore them. Like, if there was a way to make our AI guys totally ignore the horse archers, we would have a shot. But they never do. It's pretty uh, detrimental. Where is everyone? Is this not a dude? Yeah, it's a dude right in here. What are you guys doing? <sighs> what they're doing is blocking me from hitting him, is what they're doing. Despicable! Well, at least Gunhilda's pretty solid on her own. When the lag isn't stopping me. Bam! Decent amount of money, and now Ustakol might want to give us some good troops on top. Uh, let's quickly see if Zemion has any... Oh, they've got more now? Hey! Excellent. We are kind of bleeding money, though, so we got to... Keep an eye on that. So we're going to try the... What is it? Grand Heist. Let's do it. If I need to pay now, I, I, I do you know what? Okay. I will pay for the support because I'm not going to solo this again. Hopefully the support is enough because it's still worth it if I get the money. Wait, what the hell did I... Was I given? I was given shit, wasn't I? No! The shield guy's ruining everything! No! Come on! Ah! Oh, damn shield, man! Come on! <sighs> Let's see if there's any recruits in here. Loads. Holy shit. We're not paying that much money for our guys! And on that note, actually, I can't really recruit anymore because I need my guys. Oh, more Balgard Sibia Tial prisoner. We're no longer merciless! She's a reputation of the type who tries hard to be just and fair. Shit! Good Hilda's not just and fair! She's a cultist, man! Shit! Okay. I'm going to be back because I'm going to go grab all the guys. And after that, we're going to make sure that, that that description goes away. And we're back. So we are uh, two things. Uh, I think it was Mimi, the guy we have a quest with to train up from Ragnvard. He's over in Omor. Doesn't show up for us. I think it means he doesn't want to join us. I don't know what it's all about. But we were right here. Going to get our last guy in Chol that isn't imprisoned. And we noticed this. These guys are in trouble. And these are guys are not going to help, but we are. See? He's not helping. Someone has to help, even if we have crap units. Oh! Us going to help forced Svana to help. Which puts it even, apparently, at a disadvantage. Well, I'm sorry, but we're not going to let the Empire win this one. We're not going to have only losses this day. Now, we do only have... Uh, half health, and the uh, our guys, 
plans look to be very bad because they are going over here. What looks to be a defensive formation. Which is not... Okay, no, they are undetermined what they're doing. Huh? No, no, that's not what I'm trying to say. Skein, there we go. I want everybody to be on a skein behind me so they don't keep walking up into me like some morons. That's what I want. Anyway, let's get our asses handed to us then, shall we? I've just got that feeling that's going to be what it is. Come on, guys. What are they doing? I mean, look at them. What are they even doing? They're just standing up here on this hill. Oh. I'm just going to stick them down. I mean, our guys aren't doing anything anyway. Ugh. This is going to be awful. You know what? We're going to put our men back. And as soon as... Uh, the enemy engages on this clump of shit, we will go in. In the meantime, I guess we'll try and hit these darts on these guys running around. That guy has a shield? Where? Well, at least the cataphracts aren't having a good time. And there's the enemy. Oh dear, look at them! Are they even, even charging up? I don't even think so. Actually, they are moving up here. Oh my god, and the uh, and our allies are trying to run into my uh, fire here. Alright, that's what I had. Not sure what the angle is that they're going for here, but... Charge! It's time to go, guys. I said charge. Are they not charging or what? I don't see it. Oh, they are here already. Here we go. Oh my god, he hit me instead. Oh god. No, come on! Of course, man! You know what? I think the best chance we've got is to just speed it up and hope that our guys do something smart. What the hell? Oh no, do you know what? End battle. No, they didn't do smart. They decided to stand around and get shot by archers. Wow. Leave. Don't you love it when they do that? They just decide, oh, you know, archers, oh, we just gotta stand around, man. We gotta stand around and take them in the ass. Oh, yeah, I love it. That's what NPCs are like sometimes. Oh, I love taking shit up the ass. Mm. Oh, shit goes up the ass, not out. Woohoo. Jesus Christ. Mangus, come on. There we go. Jesus Christ. We need to marry another dude for some for some hard cash items, because look at us. We have no money. God, I'm really... Wait, can we uh, heal our wounds? No, we can't. Alright, we can fight. God, the studges are so stupid. Like, seriously, how stupid do you have to be to do what they have been doing? My lady, you're... Beauty's a balm to my troubles? Who is this? He's got a wife. I would like to discuss something with you. You are not... 
He's happy with the liege and he uh, doesn't want to marry me. So, uh, and you know what? Excuse me. I'll give him a star. Maybe I can marry him later and, uh, you know, take his armor for money, send troops. I'm not going to be bothering with it. And we didn't even capture him. Of course we didn't. At least in the end, it looks like we did get the upper hand here, but we need this castle back. There are no armies. Well, look at that. Yeah, well, someone's got to do stuff. Come on, let's get this shithole back. Big fat line. Alright. Everyone needs to bloody charge. We can't afford to wait. For exactly that reason. We can go up with the battering ram, but everybody else needs to bloody go. And I'm glad they listened. Because we can't afford to wait. There we go. Slap noodle these guys. Come on. There we go. Hit one. Hit another one. Come on, hit them. Okay, we're actually getting up, so that's nice. Slap. One more. Yeah. Are there no more ladders than this? There are, actually. Surprised they're not using these over here at all. It's not a smart move. We've got to diversify. Oh, there's a lot more arches over here, I guess. Okay, yeah. Uh, no, I can't. I can't go over there on my own. So I can't do that at all, actually, which is very sad. Looks like we are sort of getting up in here, or maybe not. Maybe a little bit. Someone over there is maybe going to go over the ladders, but I guess not. Hmm, they're getting not that far. Okay, there's a lot of archers waiting for us up here. There's more than a lot of archers. There's just a lot of men, periods. Oh! A lot of shield men. Jesus, this is a... Uh... Can't... I'm not even sure I'm getting to hit anything. This is a hot mess! At least I'm cleaving through them. Ah, except for the huge lag spike and then I died. Wait, what was that? Oh well, at least they're going up over there as well now. They catapulted their own men as well! That's insanity! What the hell? Oh well. We will win this, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Even though they decided to catapult their own men, we still end up winning. But damn, that was some... Jesus Christ. They catapulted their own walls! Oh, there's still some left. Well, send troops. Nice and easy, at least. Oh, troops. Nice, we need that. Well, we took it, and of course we can't do anything other than this. Uh, I'm not going to claim this, because I really don't want this piece of shit. 
I wonder if this guy is, uh... Yeah, okay, do you know what? A courier with a peace offer for the peace of the Northern Empire has arrived. Why would we do that? Wait, what do we got to vote for first? Yeah, the owner. Gunhilda? No. No, 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 no. I don't want it. Give it to this guy. I'm very grateful, guys. I'm very grateful that you want me to have it. But I don't want it. Wait, peace offer? Okay. Uh, I do want to help vote on this because I want- WHAT?! No, I'm not paying! What is wrong with you? Come on! Everybody says yes! What is wrong with them? Guess we'll keep the army for the leadership experience. God, I hate these guys so much right now. What was that all for? You wanted the war. Right, so Mimi's party is just out and about doing whatever on a party? I mean, really? Oh, maybe I can add him to the army at least. Mimi, uh, for free, yes. Come on then. Come to me, you idiot. Got a quest to do. Oreg Break Skull was... Wait. At Argaron? Really? We've got to go to bloody Argaron. Fine. Oh, what's this? Vidar needs guidance. Well, we can give that. Whoa! Vidar, what have you done? You're huge! Definitely known for his strength then, isn't he? Uh... Polam? What else do we want him to be good at? Apparently he's going a little bit for scouting, so can we do that? No. Steward's always good, though. He could be a little bit of a steward man. And some charm, why not? Charming fat dude. Nothing wrong with that, Vida. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah, okay, we're gonna get rid of everyone else from the party. We don't need them. And we'll still get XP even though Vida's not here yet, I think. Mimi, I mean, even though Mimi is not here yet. Oh, Still leading an army and all that. Alright, recent events is no longer huge. Well, I guess we're gonna have to do some crimes, because I've got a strong feeling that the crimes are what are, is increasing our morale. Right, so uh, we managed to get some money, because we were actually, uh... Don't know if you noticed, but it weren't looking so good. Wait, can't we do Fobery in an army? Are you shitting me? Come on! Stupid rules! Hey, we managed! Didn't give us any stuff though. Oh well. Yep, yeah, well, getting him back then. We, we could just kick him out momentarily when we need to do the crimes. But oh my god. Goodness, things are going like shit! Ah, oh, crushed twice, really? And... Oh, man. I mean, we got our troop count up again, which is good. And I guess we are getting closer to Calantia 3, which is going to be good. But we need... We lost our traits! We need another war, and we need another uh, husband or wife, someone who is really worthwhile. And... God, what else? Yeah, we need the money, we need the fame, we need the power. It's really not going that great. We need a war with the Northern Empire again, and then we need to take Epicrotea or something. Because we need... We need a base of operations where we can do crime. And it's just not going to be Varchek anytime soon, is it? Anyway... Yeah, next time we will marry someone else, and get our money up again, and then we will do something with war. I can feel, do you know what, after this episode, 
It's gonna go good. I can feel it in my bones. We're about to skyrocket into insane levels of power. Especially after we have a look at our, our occultists and see why they're not maybe as powerful as they should be. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.